Today, I'm putting up my um, external aerial for, um, to get Wi-Fi on the boat uh, so we can use it as an office. And I'm doing a test of uh, portable solar panels. I bought some new cheap ones from China and they're kind of a disappointment. I'll illustrate more. I've got three of them. There's a 32 watt foldy one, a supposed 40 watt semi flexible, and a um, one that I know works, which is six watts USB. So I'm just using that to compare the other two. Um, I think the 40 watts is a complete sham. I think it's probably a 10 watt panel. It gets half, it's, um, it's five watts of power in full sunshine at the right angle. And the 32 watt folding, I think, is probably about 20 watts. Yeah. It gets about 10 watts. As you can see, both the panels are angled to the sun and have full sunlight on them. And this is the power we're getting. The 32 watt panel has picked up a bit. It's gone up to 12, 13 watts. Uh, the supposed 40 watt panel, probably 10 watts, is still about five watts. I would suggest it's a 10 watt panel. Most solar panels get about half their rated power in normal conditions. So that was a false sale. I've put in a dispute. Um, let's see what AliExpress comes back with. But if you look at the size of it, it's obviously not a 40 watt solar panel. Um, compare it to this 32 foot folding. This is 32 watt folding, it's much, much bigger. It's, you know, uh, this is likely to be a 10 watt panel looking at its size and how much power it gives out. Uh, falsely advertised as 40 watts. Um, I check it with the amp meter as well, and it's 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 about right the amount of power coming in. Uh, so if you buy um, cheap Chinese solar technology, uh, port, especially the portable stuff, expect it not to be very good.